Tanis. Okay. So you were saying that Israel has a right to defend itself while sustaining babies. What I'm no, that's, shut that's up, concerning. shut up! Don't put words in my mouth. That's concerning. Don't put words in my mouth. You, that's what Wait, where's the, whose mic is this? Where is Who he? Who cares? Just talk. I bro. care. Just I want to give it back to him. Just talk. Uh, bro. Uh, keep on. Are you recording or? No, no, because he's gonna edit. He, they're gonna edit out whatever they they don't like. Do you do you edit out? Are you part of their team? I don't know. Bro. Okay. Well, that's what they do. They edit out parts they like. Yeah. And what they don't like. There you go. So I find that concerning that you think you find what concerning. First of all, why do you put words in my mouth? You can correct me. Why well, I, I just did, and that. it's on camera. So why why you can why do that? Me once I finished what I'm saying. But why do that? Why do what? Why put words in my mouth that aren't true? I haven't made my point yet. You, what point was I going to make? No, no, I, I haven't said you made a point. But Sorry, you, I haven't even made a point on, yet. But you're being dishonest from the get-go. Well, what, what dishonesty? Correct, that, you, you correct put, your stance. That, that you, no. you put words correct in my mouth. Correct your stance then. Repeat what you said. Correct your stance Repeat then. what you said. Why should I? Because. If it's a lie, it. why should I repeat a lie? Because you, you said the truth then. I'm happy it's, this is on camera. Tell yeah? the people yeah. the truth then. Okay, they'll see for themselves. What's your stance with regards to what Israel is doing in Palestine? They have a right to defend themselves. Well, against babies. Against everyone. Infant. Hold on. Are you gonna let me talk? These women. Are you gonna talk over me? Is that what we're gonna do? Should we do a minute each? Should we do a minute each? Okay, let's do a minute each. Okay, are you gonna interrupt me? Let's do a minute each. Are you gonna interrupt me? Well, in a minute each. No, because I you see. You have a minute each. No, but you, you're going to interrupt regardless, are you? Or are you not? Do you understand how a minute each works? Yes, I understand. I don't think you do though. How do so you? That's know? why. Have what, we ever met? Well, you're interrupting. You're interrupting. Have we ever met? You're interrupting me. That's because the minute hasn't started yet. Okay. So I can interrupt. Okay, you. let me talk and then have you the talk. Can we do already? that? Do you have that ability? Have the rules started do you have already? the ability to let have the rules started already? Do you have the ability? Then I can break the rules if do there you... are no rules. Okay. Oh, is that what you do? You just well, break the rules. If there if are it... no rules, so then I get to do set the rules. Want, yeah? I get to set the oh, rules. Okay, that's, not? that's interesting. Though. Is it really yeah, interesting? No, it is, it is. is it more interesting than you saying Israel has a right to defend itself against babies? Are you going to let me talk? So that's what you just said. You want to talk, talk. No, that's what you just said. And I'm glad this is recorded because he's a liar. You're a liar. You are a liar. Oh, and wow. you are accountable. Wow. You are accountable. Of course you are. You believe in God. I'm You're accountable. Right. I'm, You're accountable. You've won me over to your side. Because I don't need to win you over. Wow. Do whatever you want. You can, Bro, just make you your, can jump off a cliff for all I can. One minute, one minute. Let's go. So, one minute, make your no, so repeat, repeat what he said. So he said, for one minute. he said that I said, he said that I am talking. No, hold on. He said that I said that Israel should should kill babies. That's what you said that I said. Should we start the timer? So this is recorded. Thank you. Yes, sir. Okay. So what I think, what I think. I just said one minute, one minute. What I think. I'm going to say what it once think, more, then I'm going to walk away. What I think. Do you want to do the one minute or one minute? I, I just want to flow with it. No, I want to do the one minute, one minute. Now you want to do one minute? Yeah, yeah. One minute. Okay, go ahead. Do you okay. want to start? So I'll start. Do you want to start? I'll start. Okay. Okay, so this individual, when I was speaking to this guy that we were having a really good intellectual conversation with, mm. and he was open and There wasn't was much intellect there, there was just your side of things. So one, one second. Ah, well you're doing what I Ah, you don't like it, do you? You don't like it, do you? You don't like it. You don't like it. Okay. I haven't said anything. You don't like it. No problem. No problem. You don't like okay. it. Do you? No problem. You know what? I don't even need the full minute. Oh, he's and I so good. He doesn't I need. I want to know it. about his stance when it comes to Israel killing, maiming, raping babies, infants, yeah. and what's this whole right to defend themselves when they're the fourth or fifth largest army in the world and they're facing people with pipes underground? The floor is yours. It's quite simple. They're human beings surrounded by people who want to obliterate them off the face of the earth. Surrounded. Israel is a tiny, tiny little place. Surrounded by people who are taught to hate and kill them. It's so much so that when you're in a, one of these terrorist camps, the kids play video games killing Jews and Christians. They are taught to draw pictures killing and beheading Jews and Christians. They go through fighting camps learning how to stab, learning how to shoot, and learning how to talk Jews and Christians. What do you have to say about that? Okay, so he's talking about God knows what he was talking about. Right, yeah, I'm sure you don't so know. Yeah, yeah. He's interrupting me again. Yeah. Again, in my yeah, I will because, because you have no he respect. Knows. 
he knows what's going to happen what. now. Okay, yeah? go, on, go. So if we look at, for example, what is the reality on the ground? The reality. Are you on the ground? And then he's How dare me you again. tell the reality? If he interrupts me again, You've never guys, been in war. There's what no are you talking about? What are you, you talking about? Me again. The same reality. You interrupt me again. Okay, all right. Let's hear. You let's hear your reality again. for a minute. I'm let's walking see. away. Let's hear your reality. You interrupt me again. Please tell me the reality. I'm walking away. Please tell me the reality. I'm gonna walk away. Please tell me the reality. One minute, one minute. What? I honored the one minute. I will no, you haven't. The one no, you minute. haven't honored Did it. Did I interrupt you in you that did. one yes, minute? Yes, yes, you did. So, please. Uh, uh, what is going on? You interrupted me in the beginning. This, is, this conversation. This is Zionism 101. This conversation. This, conversa this, Zionism 101. this conversation began as soon as you opened your okay, mouth and, and you have not honored. So we know that please the, the reality. Yep. They're yep. saying yep. under two thousand of them the have been killed, and we know something called the Hannibal Directive, yeah, which is Israelis killing their own people. Why? So they won't be taken as hostages for leverage. However, according to the Lancet, a credible medical journal that's come out and that was mentioned to even the the U.S. officials as well, the spokesperson, and he acknowledged that report as well that there could be as much as a hundred and 70,000 plus Palestinians that have been killed and murdered. I asked you, how is that self-defense? You're talking to me about games? I'm talking to you about reality. Uh, that is the reality. You're one minute. Oh, I, what, what else do you want me to say? I mean, they're human beings wanting to live. What do you want them to do? Do you want them to lie down and just play dead or something? What do you want them to do? Forget this one minute. Let's just have a back and forth. No, one minute. So now you're dictating terms. No, I want to have a convo. Maybe, I don't, a Maybe I don't need a minute. Maybe I don't need a minute. Maybe I just want the convo to flow. Can we do that? Are you able to do no, that? One minute. You're one not minute. able to do that. One okay. Minute, Why are you minute. not able to do that? Can I speak now, or do you want to? Finish? No, you can speak. Okay. So you're. So he's saying, oh, there are people that are they not the human? Skin and this and that. Well, apparently Israel, to him they're, they're not. The, they're not. They're not. Apparently to him they're not. Have the fourth strongest military on the planet. They have some of the most invasive security instruments that You've have sold in to countries like Pegasus that can be installed on any phone never and spy on people without people even having this knowledge. These individuals that are getting funding from the UK, from the US, against Gaza that has a blockade. No, nothing goes in, nothing comes out. That's a lie. Very minimal that things. Wedding lie. dresses can't go in. Jam can't the go British in. The British army are Korean doing jobs on a regular basis. That's idea, a lie. Ooh, what do Hamas do? They go and take it from the people. What are the Hamas leaders the doing? They're not the even evil in Palestine. The evil wedding Stop dress. Stop me. I'm not your That's dimmy. What they're afraid I'm not your dimmy, bro. But ladies and gentlemen, you have these people that Naftali Bennett is saying, we are fighting Nazis. We are fighting Nazis. Dura Island says the former uh, Israeli head of security, she says that, you know what? Our goal is to make Gaza unlivable. Unlivable. You tell me which high-ranking Palestinian has said the same thing. Hopefully no. someone here has a brain. So I'm just going to use this analogy of the park. Every single week, the behavior of Muslims in this park. That is just but a spectacle of what Hamas does. Now, if you come here on a regular basis, you will see for yourself the fruits the fruits of Islam. You will see it for yourself. It's all over the internet. They can't defend it. They can't hide it. That is but a, a, a mere taste of what awaits you with these people. This isn't a laughing matter because when a jihadi puts a knife to your neck and says convert to Islam or we're going to kill you or do whatever, you, you'll think very differently about what's going on. This is a very serious topic. Yeah, well, yeah, <laughs> you're, you're laughing now. Are we speaking to underage kids now? Or? Right. Oh, so, yeah, so it's, it's illegal, right? What are we doing? Okay, arrest me. Go, go on, go and say the police. Go, go, go. I did say that's go wrong. Go I was go asking on. you. Go on, go uh, on. Because I did something so wrong because there. Yeah, please. Underage, yeah, actually arrest, a lot please. Of what the Israelis are doing. Yeah. The idea for peeing their pants because they're seeing these little kids come with the flags. However, he was talking about Hamas. Hold on, hold on. Can I finish? Can I just finish quickly? Uh, so I the, had finished. So the, no, so the small analogy of the, here in the park, that is what awaits you under Sharia law, under Islamic law. Now, go over to Palestine. This guy wants to talk about the reality. He's never stepped a foot in this war. Have you stepped in this war? Have you stepped a uh, foot on the soil on, in, that, in that war? Have you? No, you haven't. Okay. So, don't talk about about reality you weren't even there in fact if you are claiming to be such a Muslim as you claim why are you not over there fighting with 
the, 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 the fighters. Why are you not over there fighting with the fighters? Okay, so initially you started waffling about speaker's corner and how people come in. Uh, anyone really pop, with a brain out, can, can analyze. They cornetto ice cream and just scratch the armpit and go out. That was pretty much the summary of his argument, yeah? Now he talks about Hamas, yeah? I'll tell you about Hamas, yeah? When you look at Ron Paul, what he said in his address to Congress, when you look at what David Hasham said in 1980 in Gaza, he said that Hamas was funded by Israel. Right. Yeah? Okay. This is something that they have admitted. Avner Cohen, who was an advisor to the govern to the Israeli government, yeah. he said, you know what, to my regret, Hamas is a creation of Israel. Right. Yeah. And if I go further, I go to Yitzhak. Where's your evidence for this? This is I've very... just told you. Ron Paul, right. David Hashem, okay. 1980, Gaza. You can check both of those yeah, two they're references. They're very, out. very finish, reliable. Yeah, they're very yes. yeah, yeah, Okay, yeah, no yeah, problem. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Then you look at Yitzhak Sigev, Brigadier. The brigadier Ooh. of the IDF, oh. Yitzhak Sigev, said to the New York Times, you know what? That's true. I was actually given a budget to give to Hamas for this. So I actually agree with this. Yeah. We're talking about Avner Cohen, yeah, who is an Israeli. He is somebody that's giving advice to the Israeli government. And he's saying, yeah, you know what? To my disappointment, we did create them and we did fund them. And you know what? He's yeah. saying, what else? Yeah. What, what else is the evidence? These, I'll tell you, Benjamin Netanyahu, these are, when he's sitting in parliament, these are in the Likud party, beautiful. he's saying we need Hamas. If we don't have Hamas, it's going to be a problem. So we are, need to put them up. And what's the reference? Google this. Haaretz, a left-leaning Israeli page. All right. So these are beautiful theatrics and I applaud you for that. It's brilliant. But at the end of the day, you're going on uh, human beings. I don't trust human beings as far as I can throw them. Okay? I don't trust human beings as far as I can throw them. What I do want to, what I do want to go at is the, the humanity, if there is any, in these people. Because when they came in on October 7th, what did they do? I saw it with my own eyes. A beautiful little black Labrador dog came over to one of the Hamas fighters. What did that son of a bitch do? He took the AK-47 and he put three rounds in his head. Now tell me what human really would do that. Is, is that humane? Were you there? Were you in there? He's talking Don't about shooting. Labrador. <laughs> yeah. I'm telling you that so, the so, population that have been hold killed on. in I, Gaza half of the you're saying, under 18. So, you're so saying, I would ask on. you, you're saying that how life, does it feel when you know your idea of soldiers killing kids you're saying that, a gun Hold on, you're saying a dog's life is worthless, is that what you're saying? I'm asking you, I'm asking you a question. I'm saying a baby's life is more important than a dog's life. Do you disagree? So, so you... Are you going to start telling me no, about no, Speaker's Corner again? Are you God? <laughs> Are you God? I, I don't trust human beings. No, no. Speakers corner, Muslims coming in. Listen. What is this guy on, who, bro? Who, who does judgment belong to? Who does judgment belong to? Does it belong to you? Does it belong to you? If a person has you killed a judge. baby, Hold I'm on. the judge. You're the judge, If really? a person is killing really? a baby, I'm the judge. As far as I'm concerned, yes, I'm there's the only judge. one judge on this earth, and that's God, not you. Certainly oh, not you. So you can certainly kill not you. Did I say that? That's it's you certainly said. not you. You can't judge them. And who does revenge, judge them. Who does revenge belong judge to? Judge the baby. Who does revenge belong to? I say judge the baby. Who killers. does revenge belong to? Well, according to UN. According to who? No, no, no. The, not according the, to UN. According party. to you. According the to you. Party. Who does revenge belong to? According, according to UN. To, according to party. you, I want matter. to know. Because it doesn't matter. It does matter. People, it does person. matter. What do you have to say about it? You don't trust people. I'm a person. Say, say. You don't trust me. Say. Of course I don't trust you. Then why are you then? But say, because obviously you're well, thinking you it, aren't me you? Then. You're obviously thinking it, aren't make you? Make your argument. No, no, so say, who does revenge Stop belong to? Stop on me and make your argument. I can't help it, I have a speech impediment. Well, move back then. Uh, okay, I'll move back. Say it, don't spread I'll move back. I'll move back. Yeah. Can I move back? Sorry, guys. So, who does revenge belong to? I'm telling you, I've you asked don't accept. Don't if you don't accept what people are saying. your answer and just answer me. Who does revenge belong to? So you want me to give you your answer? No, I want you to give me then your I'll answer. answer then. Let, let me speak then. So you're saying the UN? Then let the me UN? Speak is that your answer? The United Nations. Right, okay. Are somebody we take seriously. Okay, International okay. law is somebody we take seriously. Finish, finish. Human rights watch is a 
Amen. We take you seriously. take international law seriously. Take them seriously. Please, please, when they are saying please, that their apartheid please, is taking please place, sit down. Salim. please sit down Human rights and we evaluate your life tremendously. Amnesty International are all Trem saying tremendously. an apartheid because regime is taking the place. the avenue you're going down is diabolical. You're walking into the abyss. I don't, I, don't, I don't know what else to say to someone. You haven't said anything. I have. You haven't just said one I have. Just You have no ears to one, listen one and no eyes official. to see. Got one pair of you have no ears to listen and no eyes to see. Ladies and gentlemen, since so the you will be forever seeing and hearing and never one understanding. Second. One second. I call forever seeing and journal, never knowing. Right at the beginning. The Lancet. In fact, the Lancet says four out of five people that are starving on the planet are in Gaza. Lancet, a medical peer review journal. They are also saying that at least 170,000 people the could have been killed in Palestine. I've ever I am met. calling officials. You are a hypocrite. I am quoting officials. You are a I am quoting brigadiers. A Who have you quoted? You are what have you quoted? You are nothing but a hypocrite. Quote. Give me evidence. No, I don't need to give you anything. I'll give you what I want to give you. You are no a evidence. hypocrite. The conversation is finished. You are a Ladies hypocrite. Ladies and gentlemen, yeah, what? this, what? this is what? a this week what? Yeah, yeah, pathetic, yeah, yeah, yeah. degraded yeah. Uh -huh. loser of an individual. Yeah, brilliant. And Go this home, is a brilliant man. Book, He's so mad. Man. He's so grand. And then join me next week. Wow. Because you have yeah. been disseminated. Oh, thank you. Yes. Yeah. Guys, a round of applause for me, please. Round of applause yeah. for this brilliant man. This. Thank you. Oh, wow. Pharaoh, Pharaoh, you know, you, Pharaoh. Even your enemies are clapping. Hail, 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 you know that's the hail Pharaoh. Pharaoh. Yeah. You know what happened to thank Pharaoh, though, right? Yeah? Okay. <laughs> you know what happened to Pharaoh? Is this your one? No. I think it's the other one. You know what happened to Pharaoh in the end, don't you? So I was speaking to this guy, I was hoping for some humility and honesty and I got none of that. But then I suppose I should have expected that. Part of me was hoping that I could have a sincere conversation on a human level with this uh, person. That did not happen. He just comes with his narratives and his narrow mind and you know, it's quite pathetic. And in fact, at the end, he said, I am this, 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 this. I know this man knows nothing about God, absolutely nothing. And I will pray for him because he is a lost soul. He seems to think he is grand. What happened to Pharaoh in the end after hardening in his heart, after thinking he was this grand Medusa, right? What has happened to every world leader who has thought himself grand? He has been lost to the pages of history. This is what happens to human beings. The only true person worthy of worship is the Lord. That is it. Do not grandiose yourself. Do not come with mere human pathetic arguments. It's embarrassing. He wants to talk about Palestine. He hasn't stepped a foot on that soil. About the reality. He hasn't stepped a foot on that soil. What the hell is he talking about? Reality.